Hey everybody, I wanted to talk about a topic that some students and teachers have asked me about. How do you start a conversation and continue having a conversation with someone that's new? Whether it's someone that you meet at the airport or maybe someone introduced you at a party or something, how do you have that conversation? Now, specifically, we're talking about having the conversation in English, but the same rules can apply even if the person speaks Spanish. Because you might meet someone that only speaks Spanish and have to have a conversation, most of the things that I'm going to talk about apply to those situations also. So, after you've asked their name and how are they, then what? So, why is it sometimes difficult to have conversations with people who are new? We feel awkward, we feel shy, we feel afraid, and if we are speaking in another language, we feel afraid that we're going to make a mistake, and I totally understand that. And we feel nervous. Now, if you're speaking in your first language, you might still feel afraid and shy and nervous, and that is okay. Now, it is okay, if you are speaking in English, it is okay to ask the other person to say, you know what, can you please speak slowly and carefully and clearly? That is okay to say that. I say that when I'm speaking Spanish all the time. People understand, people are kind. It's okay to ask them to speak slowly. Talk about things that you have in common. So what is something that everyone has in common if you meet each other in person? Well, the weather, maybe the news and something that's going on on the news. Maybe it's sports, maybe you're both from the same country, or you both like soccer, or you both might like something similar. Start talking about those things. Video games, possibly. Ask questions about Something that is universally true almost around the world about every single person is almost everyone likes talking about themselves. So if you can just simply ask them questions about their life and ask, oh really, so you like basketball, who is your favorite team, who is your favorite player, have you ever been to a game, do you play yourself, people can continue talking about themselves. So it's okay if they don't ask questions to you. Sometimes people aren't good at asking questions. But what I'm trying to teach you to do is to have a conversation and you might have to be the person that asks all of the questions, that initiates the conversation. It is not your responsibility for them to ask you questions. Hopefully they will, but that doesn't always happen that way. So something I'm going to do is I'm going to put a list of questions that I found on the internet in the comments and the description of this video so that you can become a better conversationalist. Questions like, if you had a magic genie and had three wishes, what would you wish for? If you could wake up tomorrow with any ability, what would it be? What was your scariest moment when you were a child? And these kinds of questions, if we have them stored in the back of our mind, start good conversations. So I hope that this was helpful, and I hope that you can come to me and practice with me. I love having good conversation. Have an awesome day, good luck, and I believe in you.